Welcome back to the Nintendo Wiretap for Wednesday, April 29th, 2020. On today's episode, we have three stories to look at, so without further ado, let's take a look. Coming in at number one today, Super Smash Bros. Ultimate is getting a new online tournament that pits Kirby against Donkey Kong. Now, I know a lot of you are just looking for fun things to do being stuck inside, myself included, and Nintendo is doing its best to give you just lots of things to do, whether it be Animal Crossing or, in this case, Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. That's right, folks, there are other games out there besides Animal Crossing right now, believe it or not. Now, starting on 5-1, that's this Friday, there's a tournament kicking off that is going to be featuring only stages and characters from Donkey Kong and Kirby games. Now, according to the announcement tweet, the further you advance in this tournament, the better spirit that you get. No word yet on what those spirits are going to be, but stay tuned to Nintendo Wire. We're going to be playing this tournament all weekend, and we'll let you know as soon as we find out. Are you still playing Smash Ultimate, or are you stuck in an Animal Crossing fog? Let me know in those comments down below. Speaking of Animal Crossing, we have to cover this very, very short story here. Japan just got the absolute biggest, beefiest strategy guide for Animal Crossing New Horizons I've ever seen. This thing looks like a phone book. So if you need an encyclopedia to hold all of the information on Animal Crossing New Horizons, and you speak Japanese, fortunately this complete strategy guide full of index marks, color-coded sections, and other little touches to help you sort through everything on your island life is coming to Japan very, very soon. Now this guide contains beautifully designed pages that include everything from information about each specific villager, to catalogs for fish and insects, to huge collections of images for all of the furniture and clothing in the game. Now just how big is this thing? Well, according to the official listing for this book, it's 1,072 pages. Compare that to the Animal Crossing guide that's coming to the US that's over 400 pages. This is definitely a lot bigger. That being said, unless you're looking to catalog literally every item in this game, it might not necessarily be the guide for everybody, but if you're an Animal Crossing nut, like I'm sure a lot of you are, you might want to pick this thing up, even if it is in Japanese. Now, if you do want to pick this thing up, I do have a link to it in the description down below. It's coming out this June, and you can order it now for under 22 bucks. Like I said, you can check out the listing down below. But there you go, the biggest, beefiest guide I've ever seen. Let me know if you're planning on picking this thing up in those comments down below. All right, finally, this is kind of a strange story, but the former president of Nintendo of America, Reggie fils is hosting a seven-part podcast for charity. Now, everybody knows Reggie, the former president of Nintendo of America and forever king of memes, has announced that he will soon be co-hosting a seven-episode podcast about the games industry to help raise money for charity. In a lengthy interview with the Washington Post, Reggie fils detailed the podcast and why he's starting it. Along with his co-host and longtime journalist Harold Goldberg, fils will interview executives and developers in the industry. The first guest is none other than Game Awards host and creator Jeff Keighley. Now, the podcast is called Talking Games with Reggie and Harold, and it's going to be free to listen to through a GoFundMe link, which is going to raise money for the New York video game Critics Circle. Now, the charity is going to be offering courses, scholarships, and internships to underprivileged youth in New York City. The podcast itself is going to feature interns who are being helped by the program. Now, if you want to listen to this podcast when it comes out, I have a link to the GoFundMe page that it's going to be on in those comments down below if you want to check it out. But there you go, folks. That is all of the biggest stories today in the world of Nintendo. But if for some reason that wasn't enough to feed your hearty Nintendo appetite, head over to NintendoWire.com for even more amazing Nintendo news, including some pretty cool stories that we just didn't have time to cover in this episode. Once again, that is NintendoWire.com. See you next time, folks, and until then, stay wired in. Bye, guys. Wow.